Hello people of the internet, my name is CJ, and today I thought it might be fun to make a video about my 18th century civilian impression. What this impression is supposed to be is basically just a wealthy New York colonist around the late 18th century. Um, so yeah, let's get into the different pieces of clothing. So the first and most basic item of clothing we have here is of course the shirt. Uh, this shirt uh, is made of linen. It was made by Ian Graves of Royal Blue Traders. And if you want to know more about it, I already have a video about it on my channel. So go watch that if you want to know more about the shirt. The next item of clothing we have are the stockings. Uh, they're nothing really fancy, they're just white stockings. Next we have the breeches. Again, these aren't anything special, they're just uh, plain white breeches with pewter buttons. And yeah, that's basically it. Breeches. And of course, the main part of this impression, and the reason I had to specify earlier that this was a wealthy civilian, is this jacket right here. Uh, this is um, a purple jacket, and of course, back before synthetic dyes existed, purple dye was very expensive. Also, the buttons, you may notice, are a relatively fancy design. Uh, so yes, this jacket is made of uh, purple wool flannel and um, sewn with uh, blue linen thread, and it has these nice decorative pewter buttons. This one actually... Um, made myself with uh, quite a bit of help from my mom, but um, yes, I think it looks pretty nice. Next we have these shoes. These are just uh, leather shoes with brass buckles. Um, these are the same shoes that I wear with all my other 18th century clothing, um, and this is the one impression where the very fancy shoe buckles actually work, because again, this would have to be a rather wealthy civilian uh, to have um, the purple jacket that I showed earlier. After that we have the hat. Uh, this hat isn't anything really fancy, it's just a uh, standard black uh, wool felt cocked hat. Uh, it doesn't have any special decoration or cockades or anything, it's just a plain uh, cocked hat. And finally, to look extra sophisticated, we have a sword. Uh, this particular sword is a 1751 British infantry hanger. So that's pretty cool. Anyway, I hope you have enjoyed this video about my late 18th century civilian impression. Thank you for watching. Goodbye. I've been a wild rover for many years. I spent all my